Alright guys, what is up? So it is Thursday, meaning it is the GTA Online event week and we have got business battle themed this week being boosted profits in all business battles this week plus rumoured of diamonds in the vault, clothing unlocks and more. So obviously we're going to start off with the main thing being that if you are some someone who enjoys doing the heists and you enjoy the casino heist, we have got diamonds returned to the vault of the casino and resort. So if you go through normal as per normal, do the heist, uh, find out what it is in the vault that you're going to be getting. If you got diamonds, then banging job for you. If not, try again until you get them. Two times money and RP on the land grab adversary mode. It says play any game of land grab and receive two times money and RP all week long. In the brutal cyberspace, every minute counts. Occupy as many zones as you can before the clock runs down. Armed opponents will resist though, so keep your wits about you and your finger on the trigger so it's more of a kind of like a Tron styled without the bikes so you just gotta go through different zones turn them into your color that you're wearing and whoever has the most zones colored or whoever like yeah whoever has the most obviously wins who has the second most comes second and so on also for this week if you log in you receive a lemon sports tracksuit now I have got some shots from in game of what this looks like it's basically the newly added uh, tracksuit and everything just in yellow um, why that's special I'm not too sure but it's very bright as all GTA players who play this week will receive a Dashing lemon sports tracksuit, both pants and top for free. So we've got some free clothing, quite bright. There we go. The Lucky Wheel vehicle is one of the new ones. It is the Coquette D10. Now I did do a video on this really nearish about when it came out. Um, Performance-wise, eh? I th it's got. I'll leave a link to the video I did, but just a brief description of it. It's very nice when it comes to the styling and appearance. Uh, however, performance-wise, I believe it's got the speed. Uh, it's not as quickly as accelerating as the Pariah, but I think it has got the speed there. However, the control and the traction, not so much. It's it's not very good at going around a a normal like a normal corner at a high speed. Uh, I did try doing this in a race which you will see in that video that I link in the description below um, but yeah it's still a very nice car discounts are this week 40% off bunkers so any of the bunkers that you can if you have not got one you've got a chance to get 40% off them along with 30% off the bunker modification so this style personal quarters shooting range gun locker transportation being the uh, little like golf caddy things the MOC weaponized vehicle workshop as well is also 30% off some vehicles now for some reason once again we have got the long line of classic or sports classics which I'm not going to go through but it's the same as it has been for the past three weeks and it's annoying we have got the Pegasus Zentorno classic no Pegasus Zentorno which is a beauty at 30% off the uh, yoga I think classic 4x4 newly added very fun vehicle lots of different types of customization and liveries and the Landstalker XL which I would not recommend buying because one it's only 25% off the million plus price tag on it and two its performance is very poor and it is a st st stupid vehicle just, just don't buy it just because it's stupid 
and 40% uh, of the Ocelot Ardent, which is a weaponized vehicle, and a, the Declasse weaponized Tampa, which is also 40% off. All of this obviously ending um, the September 16th. The premium race is down down the drain which is one of the classic um land races basically it's it's very straightforward you're going from one side well you're going around the drain or the whatever it's called um the time trial is el Boro heights and the rc time trial is vespucci beach now apart from i mean there's not a lot happening but i am kind of peeved about the sports classic thing this is now week number four where we have had the same line of sports classic vehicles minus in two well minus in one for sure that i know is good um being the infernus classic or the ferrari f40 i believe it is but whatever Anyway, hope you guys all enjoyed. Hopefully you guys also like the new thumbnail idea. Um, I'm probably going to be doing them like that a bit more often, just because it gives it gives a bit more information on the actual video itself. But if you did like them, please, well, if you did enjoy and it was helpful in any way, then please do leave a like, leave a comment. What your either what your favourite thing is for this week, what your favourite vehicle is discounted, if you enjoy the D10 that is on the podium vehicle and if you're going to be getting it, or what you are hoping for next week, if you have been building up stuff. Um, so, yeah. And, obviously, if you continue to enjoy then do not forget to subscribe and click the notification bell to be notified when any future videos are updated on Leash to the channel and I will see you all in the next one.